With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. If we talk about this question, in this question we are asked that what are the components of the transport system in human beings? What are the functions of these components? Right? So if we talk about the transport system here, so it is the circulatory system in human beings. Right? If we talk about the transport system, so in general we have to talk about the circulatory system in human beings and if we talk about their components, right, the components of circulatory system in human beings are basically the number one, uh, number one is the heart, right, number one is heart, number two is basically the blood, right and the number three are the blood vessels right number three are the blood vessels right now if we talk about the heart so basically heart is the organ right where the deoxygenated blood goes right it receives or it get it gets the deoxygenated blood right from various body parts right and then this deoxygenated blood is sent to the lungs right is sent to the lungs by the heart itself right where and then in the lungs it is sent for its oxygenation right for its purification right for its purification or we can say for the addition of oxygen and removal of the carbon dioxide from the blood right once the blood is oxygenated it returns back to the heart right oxygenated blood returns back to the heart and then this heart pumps blood back right pumps the blood right pumps the blood to all the body parts right to all the body parts so this complete cycle of um, you know the of remove of uh, uh, sending the deoxygenated blood to the lungs and then sending the oxygenated blood to all the body parts is all carried out by the heart right now who actually or what actually carries the blood uh, carries the uh, basically various nutrients or the oxygen or the CO2 or whatever waste are there in our body that is the blood right so the function of blood is to basically transport right is to transport the oxygen carbon dioxide nutrients right nutrients and um, nitrogenous waste right nitrogenous waste etc all this is transported by blood from one body part to another now this blood is transported via blood vessels which are basically veins arteries right veins arteries and the capillaries right and the capillaries so basically in our body veins arteries and the capillaries they help in circulating the blood right they all three help in circulating the blood right that carries the various various things from one body part to another body part as we have seen here right so this is these are the components of the circulatory system in human beings and their function right for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today